Imagine stepping into a world where the boundaries of time blur, a world where the rugged landscapes of ancient earth play host to an encounter as improbable as it is fascinating. Today, we embark on a journey, a voyage across the vast expanse of prehistory to explore a tantalizing what-if scenario that defies the conventional timelines of our planet's past. This is not just a story. It's an exploration of possibilities, a dive into the depths of our imagination fueled by the fires of scientific curiosity and creative speculation. Our tale begins with the Neanderthals, our enigmatic cousins who roamed the Earth roughly between 400,000 and 40,000 years ago. These were beings of remarkable resilience and ingenuity, equipped with tools of stone and bone, masters of fire, and artists of the ancient world. Neanderthals are known to have hunted giants like straight-tusked elephants and woolly mammoths. Theirs was a life of survival against the elements, a testament to the enduring spirit of humanity in the face of Earth's relentless cycles of ice and thaw. But what if, in our story, we bend the rules of time? Let's cast our gaze even further back to an era when giants ruled the land. The Age of Dinosaurs, a period that spanned from about 230 million to 66 million years ago, long before the first human ancestors would even glimpse the light of the sun. These colossal creatures, ranging from the towering gentle giants that shook the ground with every step, to the fierce predators whose roars echoed through the ancient forests, dominated every corner of the planet. Now imagine a world where these two vastly different chapters of Earth's history collide. What if Neanderthals had to face dinosaurs? This is the heart of our exploration today. Through the lens of scientific knowledge and a dash of creative speculation, we will weave a narrative that bridges the immense gap between these two eras. We delve into a realm of imagination where the survival skills of Neanderthals are put to the ultimate test against the might and majesty of the dinosaur kingdom. Join us as we embark on this journey, a thought experiment that seeks to illuminate the incredible adaptability and ingenuity of Neanderthals, while paying homage to the awe-inspiring creatures that once roamed our planet. This is a story of what might have been, a tale that stretches the fabric of time to bring together two of the most fascinating chapters in the history of life on Earth. As our journey into this imagined past unfolds, we delve deeper into the world of the Neanderthals, beings not so different from ourselves, whose resilience and ingenuity allowed them to thrive across the harsh and varied landscapes of ancient Earth. The Neanderthals were masters of adaptation, their survival hinging on a profound understanding of their environment. Armed with tools fashioned from stone and bone, they hunted, gathered, and navigated the challenges of a world in constant flux. Their social structures were complex, bound by ties of kinship and cooperation, essential for survival in an era where the collective strength of the group often meant the difference between life and death. In the shadowy forests and vast plains of this ancient world, the Neanderthals developed sophisticated survival strategies. They harnessed fire, not just as a source of warmth against the cold nights, but as a tool for cooking, which unlocked vital nutrients from their food and as a weapon to ward off predators. Their shelters, ranging from simple lean-tos to complex structures built from bones and hides, provided refuge from the elements and space for their communities to grow. But in the heart of our speculative tale, these Neanderthal societies find themselves juxtaposed against a backdrop teeming with creatures of an entirely different magnitude, the dinosaurs. To bring this imagined encounter to life, 
we introduce a cast of dinosaurs that showcases the incredible diversity of these ancient giants. From the towering Brachiosaurus, whose long necks allowed them to reach the tender leaves of the highest trees, to the formidable Tyrannosaurus rex, the apex predator of its time, with jaws capable of crushing bone. We also meet the swift and agile Velociraptors, small but fierce hunters that roamed in packs, their sharp claws and keen intelligence making them formidable hunters. And then there are the Triceratops, with their massive heads adorned with three horns and a large frill, a herbivore that could stand its ground against the most determined of predators. Each of these dinosaurs, from the gentle giants that grazed on the ancient flora to the cunning predators that stalked the prehistoric landscapes, presents a unique set of challenges and scenarios for our Neanderthal protagonists. Let's explore the interactions between Neanderthal society and these diverse dinosaur species. How would the presence of such creatures influence Neanderthal hunting strategies, social organization, and even their tool-making? Would dinosaurs become the ultimate test of Neanderthal adaptability and resilience, pushing them to develop new strategies for survival in a world shared with these prehistoric giants? As we set the stage for this extraordinary encounter, we marvel at the adaptability of the Neanderthals, a testament to the enduring spirit of human innovation and the awe-inspiring diversity of the dinosaurs, rulers of the earth, long before humans walked its landscapes. Together, they form the foundation of our thought experiment, a tale of what might have been if two of the most fascinating chapters in the history of life on earth had somehow, against all odds, intersected. In this imagined realm where timelines converge, the presence of dinosaurs introduces a profound shift in the Neanderthals' way of life, particularly in their hunting and gathering practices. The lush landscapes that once offered a bounty of familiar prey and edible plants now teem with creatures of an entirely different scale and nature. The question arises, how would Neanderthals adapt their survival strategies to coexist with these colossal neighbors? The introduction of dinosaurs into the Neanderthals' ecosystem would undoubtedly compel them to rethink their hunting strategies. Smaller, more agile dinosaurs might become new targets for these adept hunters. Armed with spears and the element of surprise, Neanderthals could potentially hunt down smaller theropods or juvenile dinosaurs, whose meat would provide a rich source of nutrition. However, such endeavors would not be without risk, requiring new tactics and perhaps even the development of more sophisticated weapons or traps to safely bring down these powerful creatures. Scavenging from dinosaur kills presents another intriguing possibility. The aftermath of a predator's feast could offer Neanderthals a bounty of leftovers, providing an easier, albeit still dangerous, way to procure meat. This opportunistic strategy would require them to navigate the vicinity of apex predators like the Tyrannosaurus rex, turning the Neanderthals into stealthy scavengers who must weigh the risks and rewards of approaching these dining sites. The threat posed by predatory dinosaurs would drive Neanderthals to innovate and fortify their defense mechanisms. The construction of more robust shelters would become a necessity. Imagine Neanderthals enhancing their dwellings, using not just bones and hides, but perhaps even incorporating dinosaur bones into their structures for added strength and protection against a curious or aggressive dinosaur. Fire, a crucial element of Neanderthal survival, would take on new significance as a defensive tool. Beyond its use for warmth and cooking, fire could serve as a deterrent against nocturnal predators, its light and heat keeping at bay those drawn by the scent of food or the warmth of the Neanderthal encampments. The strategic use of fire could transform a vulnerable campsite into a fortified haven,
where the flickering flames ward off the shadows of prehistoric predators. Weapons, too, would evolve in response to these new threats. Spears and arrows might be crafted not just for hunting, but for defense, designed to pierce the tough hides of attacking dinosaurs. The development of new weapons, perhaps even early forms of protective gear, would be driven by the need to survive encounters with creatures whose strength and size far surpass that of any mammalian predator known to Neanderthals. In this thought experiment, the presence of dinosaurs acts as a catalyst for Neanderthal innovation, pushing them to adapt their hunting and gathering practices and to develop new defensive strategies. This imagined scenario not only highlights the resilience and adaptability of Neanderthals, but also offers a glimpse into the dynamic interplay between human ancestors and the majestic creatures of Earth's distant past. In the heart of our thought experiment, where the ancient footprints of Neanderthals cross paths with the colossal tracks of dinosaurs, lies a complex tapestry of potential coexistence and inevitable conflict. This imagined intersection of epochs, while fraught with challenges, also opens the door to scenarios where man and dinosaur might share the earth in a delicate balance of harmony and tension. In the verdant valleys and sprawling plains of this prehistoric world, there exist pockets where the gentle giants of the dinosaur kingdom roam. Here, among the towering brachiosaurs and the vast herds of triceratops, Neanderthals might find a semblance of peaceful coexistence. These herbivorous behemoths, focused on the bountiful foliage that makes up their diet, would likely pose little direct threat to human ancestors, their immense size and strength serving more as a marvel of nature than a source of fear. In such environments, Neanderthals could adapt their lifestyles to live alongside these creatures, perhaps even benefiting from the dinosaurs' ability to clear dense vegetation or their role in shaping the ecosystem. The presence of large herbivores might lead to richer soil and more diverse plant life, indirectly supporting the Neanderthals' own hunting and gathering activities. In this shared landscape, a mutual respect could emerge, with Neanderthals learning to interpret the behaviours of these dinosaurs, avoiding conflicts and living in a state of cautious harmony. However, where there is coexistence, conflict inevitably follows. The same lands that offer shelter and sustenance to Neanderthals and herbivorous dinosaurs alike are also prowled by the fearsome predators of the age. Carnivorous dinosaurs, driven by their insatiable hunger, would pose a direct threat to Neanderthal communities, their predatory instincts potentially leading them to view humans as prey. Beyond the immediate danger of predation lies the subtler yet equally challenging issue of competition. Neanderthals and dinosaurs vying for the same resources, be it water, shelter or food, could lead to tensions as each species struggles to secure its survival. Such competition could drive Neanderthals to innovate, developing new hunting techniques, crafting more effective tools, and perhaps even experimenting with early forms of agriculture to reduce their reliance on the increasingly contested wild resources. The threat of carnivorous dinosaurs would also catalyze the evolution of Neanderthal defensive strategies. From the construction of more fortified settlements to the development of advanced weaponry and tactics for deterring or even confronting these predators, Neanderthals would be pushed to the limits of their ingenuity and resilience. In this imagined world of coexistence and conflict, the interactions between Neanderthals and dinosaurs serve as a crucible for human innovation and adaptation. The challenges posed by living in a world shared with dinosaurs would not only test the physical and intellectual capabilities of Neanderthals, but also foster a deep understanding of the natural world, 
shaping the very essence of human survival and ingenuity. As our thought experiment journeys through this ancient landscape, we are reminded of the enduring power of life to adapt and thrive in the face of unimaginable challenges. In the dance of coexistence and conflict between Neanderthals and dinosaurs, we see a reflection of the timeless struggle for survival, a testament to the resilience and adaptability that define the essence of life on Earth. As our journey through this world where Neanderthals walk alongside dinosaurs draws to a close, we find ourselves reflecting on the myriad of scenarios we've explored. From the initial awe-inspiring encounters to the complex dynamics of coexistence and conflict, each step of this imaginative exploration has taken us deeper into a world that never was but could have been, had the threads of time woven a different tapestry. We ventured into this narrative with a sense of wonder, contemplating how Neanderthals, with their remarkable adaptability and ingenuity, might have navigated a world shared with the majestic and formidable dinosaurs. We speculated on their hunting and gathering practices, pondering the possibility of Neanderthals targeting smaller dinosaurs or scavenging from the kills of apex predators. We imagined the evolution of their defensive strategies, from the construction of fortified shelters to the development of new weapons, all in response to the presence of these prehistoric giants. By contemplating these speculative interactions, we gain a deeper appreciation for the complexity of Earth's past and the myriad forms of life that have shaped its history. It encourages us to think critically about the evidence we have and to ask what-if questions that push the boundaries of our knowledge and imagination. How do you imagine Neanderthals would have interacted with dinosaurs? What strategies might they have developed to survive and thrive in such a world? Do you think such speculative explorations are valuable in understanding our past? We invite you to dive into the comments section below and share your ideas, theories, and reflections. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the realms of imagination and science, where the mysteries of Earth's history continue to inspire and intrigue.